Now, just so you know, Dr. Charles Atudo is Africa's premier brand strategist and engagement consultant. As always, it's so good to have you. Pleasure is mine. Good morning. Fantastic. Okay, so when we talk about change, mm -hmm. uh, I, mm -hmm. I've always believed that it takes some superhuman to mm -hmm. embrace change mm -hmm. easily. First, why, is, why is that usually the case? Because um, it's inevitable. Mm. Change and uncertainty is, not, is totally inevitable. Mm. It's like waking up every day and um, you open up your eyes. Mm. It's inevitable. Mm. So in a fast-paced uh, world, it's a constant. Mm. So it's inevitable. It's like asking yourself, why do I have to go to, to sleep at night? It's inevitable. You must sleep. Mm. Unless you have a disorder. <laughs> Mm, very true. So it's change okay. and uh, uncertainty is inevitable in life. It's like growth. Oh, okay, it, so in what ways uh, can we uh, embrace change? I think for me the first, today I want to try and see if I can rush through my eight points. Um, uh, my first point is that you must acknowledge the reality. Acknowledge the reality. reality. That yes, you must acknowledge it. That change that, has happened. That's happened. Something different. Yes, so acknowledge the reality that um, um, change is natural. It's a natural phenomenon. Mm. You have to accept it. Mm. If you don't, it means you're still stuck in yesterday. Mm. When change occurs, mm. there must be the mental state to adopt. Mm. Humans are naturally not adopting mm. because that's how we are as humans. But unfortunately, at times, we, we go into denial. Mm. It can't happen to me. Mm. Or it has not happened. Mm. So it's a mental state. Mm. And... So you have to accept that it's inevitable, mm. okay? So you have to also develop what I call the growth mindset. Growth mindset, yes. okay? If change doesn't happen, how can you grow? Mm. Without change, you can't grow. Mm. It's like your, your nails. Mm. It's inevitable. They must grow. Your hair must grow. Mm. So accept it that um, one is inevitable. Develop the mindset that is part of growth. Mm. Because without it, there was no growth. Every experience we go through adds value to our memory bank. True. Every experience you go through is either a positive in your memory bank or, or a negative. negative. That's true. So the better, the better off you are if you accept hmm. that it has, it's inevitable. So have the growth mindset. Then also, number th point three is cultivate resilience. Cultivate now, resilience. Resilience, okay. okay. When you accept that change must happen, it's inevitable. And uncertainty is inevitable. Mm. Why must you have resilience? Resilience is the, act, act, the ability to, to, to grow into and withstand the pangs of growth. Mm. The, the, the spirit of resilience is in all of us. Humans have the resilience, the spirit of resilience. We all have it. We all have the capacity. Mm. But you see, it's in different grades. and re, we, we all have different um, thresholds. Mm. So accept that it must happen. So when you have the, the, the mindset of for resilience, mm -hmm. it puts you, conditions you in a, in a, in a, to a point where mm -hmm. you know that I must adopt. To digress a bit, yes. you know this resilience mm -hmm. and stretching part, it has me thinking of something I mm -hmm. hear often. Mm -hmm. I've been stretched to my limits. I've been stretched beyond my limits. <laughs> Is it possible to actually get stretched beyond mm -hmm. your limits or you still haven't reached your limits if you keep being stretched? I don't think that we all, we get to the point where we have, we've gone beyond our, our limits. Hmm. It's, the, your, it's you, your mindset and adapting to realities. Hmm. For instance, you, you have got a job mm -hmm. and you are enjoying that, that the function mm -hmm. and the, the management transfers you to a different department. Hmm. We are going to meet new people. You have to make new friends. Mm. Learn now, new things as well. Now, the challenge here is that you have to grow out of your old role mm. and grow into a new role mm. with more responsibilities. Mm -hmm. For some people, they stay in the, they stay in the old, the, with the old mindset mm. and go into the new role with the old mindset. Mm. That is where resilience comes in. Mm. Adaptability. Adaptability. We need to be able to adapt mm. to, set, to new situations. Mm. So that's where resilience comes in. Now... Apart from resilience, you have to have flexibility. Flexible. A lot of us are too stiff. Mm, too 
so rigid. Comfort zones. Yeah. I'm in my comfort zone. Uh, the I'm unpopular used to, comfort I'm, zone. I'm huh? used to Francis and Mozino and I love I love my kitchen setting. Meanwhile, they're pushing you into management. Mm. That should make you create a new mindset mm. for expanding your capacity. Mm. So flexibility. Most of the time we don't we're not flexible. We're mm. too stiff. Because we are we are used to being in that space. We are too caught in our ways. Comfort zones are dangerous zones. Hmm. So, apart from flexibility, I think that we also have to, have to practice mindfulness. Mindfulness? Yes, because you see, it's the practice of being fully present in the now. And being in control of your present situation. You have, to, you have to practice mindfulness. What it does for you is it ensures that you get to a state where you are in the present, hmm. not in the past. Hmm. So your growth has to go with mindfulness because your state of mind accepts your present, hmm. not the yesterday. Hmm. So we need to adopt, understand mindfulness. Hmm. And then for me, if you look at all the steps, the most critical one for me is about embracing change hmm. we need to embrace it hmm. growth does not come from comfort zones True. you need to embrace it so if you don't embrace the change you can't even adopt to the change and the growth hmm. so how do you now understand uncertainty and change and growth because it's part of life so it's it's about the human mind understanding that it's all part of the human experience. Hmm. So if you do not change your mindset, you will resist the growth. And that's why you have a lot of people, they stay in the negative hmm. when change happens. Hmm. Because they've not adjusted mentally to the reality. Hmm. And that's where the mindfulness comes in critically. Understanding the state of now, the, the, the present. Presence. This is the present, hmm. okay? So finally, I'll wrap it up to us. When you ag accept that the uncertainty is inevitable, mm. you will adjust to the reality mm. and then now focus on adaptability to the reality. Mm. Because that's the only way. If you stay in your old, in the past, the world moves ahead. Yeah. Time with, <laughs> it doesn't stand a, a lot for of anybody. People, grow because they adopt and move into the, next, the present. The people you see that do not grow are those that refuse to adopt mm. to the reality. Mm. So it's all about the mindset and understanding that it's about adopting, having mindfulness, and then understand that change is inevitable, mm. and then growth must come with the pangs mm. of the present, or else you are staying in the same position without any growth. Mm. That, that, this, this is profound. This is profound because we, we, we tend to look at embracing change mm -hmm. and uh, reality mm -hmm. as uh, something huge. Mm -hmm. But you've been able to break it into mm -hmm. easy steps that one can easily understand, which, which is quite helpful. But finally, um, I think that people should focus on what they can control. Mm. Focus on what... Which is what's within. Yes. You, can, what you can't can control, you control what's outside. You can't control change, inevitability, but what can you control? How you react to it. How you react to it. Mm. You got it. I told you last week you're a good student. <laughs> <laughs> I try. I try. I thank you so much pleasure. indeed for your time, Dr. Pleasure. Charles Otudio. Always a pleasure, pleasure uh, learning smile. from you. Thank pleasure. you indeed. And thank you as well for watching Wake Up Nigeria. We're far from done though. Uh, this is just the first hour gone by. We still have 45 minutes on the other side. Please stay with us.